Formula One may have finally broken into America, but one of its major feeder series star teams, Prema Racing, is set to go native, with the squad joining IndyCar from 2025. The Italian outfit, which celebrated its 40th anniversary in December last year, currently competes in eight series, including F2 and F3, and has won 80 championships in that time, with a string of upcoming top drivers, including Oscar Piastri and Charles Leclerc. And René Rossen, team principal of Prema and son of co-founder Angelo, says now is the right time for the brand to expand stateside. It's a new challenge for us. We are always looking to find new adventure, new possibility to expand, not only for our drivers, but as well for mechanics, engineers. So giving the opportunity to growing up within with us, uh, within our structure and our business is something that we're always looking forward. Prema, based in the northern Italian town of Grisignano di Zocco, not far from Venice, will run two Chevrolet-powered cars out of a new facility in Indianapolis, where many IndyCar teams are based. Ensuring it can attract the best people to be competitive from the start, with its desire to be a protagonist in the series. The Prema IndyCar project will be run by Piers Phillips, former president of Ray Hall Letterman Lanigan, who says he can succeed where others like Carlin have failed, given his varied experience in everything from British F3 to the World Endurance Championship. Having, you know, worked in both sides of the Atlantic and had success on both sides of the Atlantic, you understand the strengths, um, but the racing's different, you know, and I think it's important that you come in and respect the championship and respect the series for what it is. Given Prema's long history in building up teams and drivers, everyone from Jacques Villeneuve to Ryan Briscoe, Esteban Ocon to Andrea Kimi Antonelli, you wouldn't bet against them. Thanks for watching. To stay up to speed on all things Formula One, make sure you hit the subscribe button.